Want to see more cool videos on our channel? We do, so press this bell and enable to send notifications. The world is filled with beautiful places to visit from shore to shore. But what about the anomalies of the world? Nature doesn't always do things by the book, and there are a few creepy, strange and seemingly impossible places to prove it. Number 10. Silphra Rift It's the only place on the planet where it's possible to swim directly between the two continents, North America and Europe. It's the place where the two massive tectonic plates meet and are slowly drifting apart at around 2 centimeters every year, causing earthquakes about once every decade. The rift sits in the gap between the North American and Eurasian continental plates, where an imperfect seam allows explorers into the watery depths an opportunity to dive towards the center of the Earth, where visibility is often as good as 300 feet between lava rock cliffs. Even the waters in Silphra are unique. Since no rivers flow into Pingvalavatan Lake, the water actually gets slowly extruded through the porous tectonic rock beneath the water's surface. This process filters the water and not only accounts for the lake's incredible clarity, but also makes the lake mostly safe to drink. Pushing water through stone is not very quick no matter how porous the rock, so it takes between 50 to 100 years for the liquid to become part of the lake. Each drop of water in Silphra is likely over a century old. Photos of Silphra abound and even amateur divers and photographers can find that their experience between the plates is like nothing else on Earth or in its waters. Number 9. Stone Forest The Xilin Forest is believed to have existed in China's Yunnan province for over 270 million years. That's because instead of trees, this stone forest is made up of towering, pillar-like rock formations. Trees dot the stone landscape, adding bursts of greenery to an otherwise grey scene. Located about 50 miles from Kunming, the provincial capital of the Yunnan province, China's Stone Forest remains one of the country's most visited locations, and it's not hard to see why. The Stone Forest supposedly took about 270 million years of erosion and seismic activity to create, and it spans a space of about 100,000 acres. Caves, waterfalls and other topographical features make the region extremely diverse, but karst makes it spectacular. Karst is a type of landscape that's formed by the dissolution of soluble rocks like limestone, dolomite and gypsum. The Chinese stone forest is home to numerous karst features that only exist in this region of the world. In fact, the forest has been internationally acclaimed as the Museum of Stone Forest Karst due to its diverse and plentiful karst types. Number 8. Hinatuan Enchanted River Hidden in the Philippine jungle is a short stretch of river that seems to pop up out of the ground just to send its miraculously clear blue water out to the sea. The Hinatuan Enchanted River in Mindanao, Philippines, is a flawless saltwater river that flows into the Pacific Ocean. It's around 80 feet deep and just barely long enough to be considered a river, yet the flow attracts visitors from around the world who want to experience the beautiful waters that locals have long thought to be miraculous. Its moniker, Enchanted River, came from a poem by Modesto Farallan. In fact, no one is sure exactly where the salt water emanates from, although the prevailing theory involves an underground cave system that spits the river out, free of any dirt or silt which would usually cloud such a stream. Whatever the explanation, the clean waters are a natural wonder unlike any other. Local legends tell all sorts of stories about the river, one of which states that fairies added some mesmerizing colors of sapphire and jade to the river. Another legend states that the river is home to a mysterious fish that's impossible to catch. In 2017, the local government prohibited swimming in the main pool for preservation and maintenance. At the same time, they designated a swimming area some 33 feet or 10 meters away from the pool. Travelers should keep in mind that the infrastructure by the river is close to zero. Thus, there are no facilities to buy medicine or food. Number 7. White Desert just a few hours from the bursting metropolis of Cairo lies a desert that'll make you feel like you've landed on the surface of the moon. Formed by centuries of erosion and sandstorms, these unique calcium rock formations crop up across the landscape like great abstract statues. Some that resemble food have been given names like mushroom and ice cream cone, while others have inspired some grandiose designations such as the monolith and Inselberg. Arguably, the most characteristic of these peculiar natural formations is the famed chicken and tree, also called chicken and mushroom, or better yet, chicken and atomic bomb. 
Only in the White Desert will you encounter such a bizarre and awe-inspiring natural museum of chalk rock. Number 6. Mud Volcanoes In 2001 in Azerbaijan, something unexpected happened. The ground began to move in an unusual way. It looked as though an animal was trying to get out of the ground. There was a big explosion and a huge flame started coming from the hillside. The flame was unbelievably big, about 300 meters high. It was surrounded by dense black smoke and lots of mud was being thrown into the air, recounted a local. Visible from 15 kilometers or 9 miles away, three days later the flames were still burning. What had taken place was an eruption, not one of magma, but of mud. Known as mud volcanoes, they form in places where pockets of underground gas have found a weak spot in the earth where they can force their way to the surface. Because they're not caused by magma, the mud volcanoes, rather than being hot, can be very cold indeed, just above freezing. Over a thousand mud volcanoes are known to exist in the world, and some 400 of those are in the coastal area of Azerbaijan. While mud volcanoes never grow to the size of a normal volcano, topping out at around 10 kilometers in diameter and 700 meters in height, among the largest mud volcanoes in the world are Boyuk, Kanazagad, and Turagai, both in Azerbaijan. They do occasionally get the chance to show off, as happened in 2001. Every 20 years or so, one of these mud or gas volcanoes will ignite deep below the surface and create a massive explosion. Number 5. Lensois Maranhenses National Park An oasis in the middle of the desert makes a pretty picture, but they're few and far between in most of the world's arid regions. Lensois Maranhenses National Park, on the other hand, is absolutely peppered with them. Located in northeastern Brazil, this sand-covered 155,000-acre park isn't actually a desert, even though it looks like one. It's located right outside the Amazon jungle and receives the same amount of rainfall you would expect to see in a tropical rainforest. When the rainwater collects between the dunes, it forms thousands upon thousands of separate lagoons that stretch as far as the eye can see. Each lagoon functions as a completely unique ecosystem. Despite the lack of inlets or outlets, many of the standalone lagoons are filled with fish that were carried to the pools as eggs by seabirds. But since the sandy ground is largely devoid of nutrients, very little vegetation grows in Marinenses, turning it into a sort of combination of two worlds, like oil and water stirred into the same bowl. Number 4. Saltiest Pond on Earth At the bottom of the world, in a frigid Antarctic desert, sits a weird pond only a few inches deep, but so salty, it stays liquid even at temperatures of minus 58 degrees Fahrenheit. The source of the pond's unusually heavy and pure load of salt has been a geochemical mystery since it was discovered during a 1961 expedition. Scientists had generally assumed that Don Juan Pond, a play on the names of the expedition's helicopter pilots, was fed by deep underground water. But a widely publicized 2013 paper suggested that the salts came from a shallower source. The salt in Don Juan Pond isn't the same as the stuff they get sprinkled on food. Instead, it's 95% calcium chloride, which significantly lowers the freezing point of water, helping the pond stay liquid even into the bitter Antarctic winter. It's rare for nature to produce a water solution so pure, said study co-author Jonathan Toner, a geochemist at the University of Washington. From a chemistry perspective, it's kind of like walking into the room and seeing a pink elephant, he told Live Science. Number 3. Pink Sands Beaches you may have heard of white and black sand beaches, but what about shores with pink sands? Though rare, several pink sand beaches can be found in countries around the world, including Greece and Indonesia. As if turquoise seas weren't stunning enough, pairing them with blush-colored sands makes for a photo no Instagram filter can rival. Number 2. Yongul Dragon Hole a 300-meter-deep reverse cone-shaped underwater sinkhole found near the Paracel Islands, also known as Zisha, in the South China Sea, is now claimed by China's marine authority as the deepest of its kind worldwide. Officially named Yongul Dragon Hole, the 300.89-meter blue hole located about 25 kilometers south of Discovery Reef is comparable with the height of the Eiffel Tower. It's more than 100 meters deeper than the better-known Dean's Blue Hole, which is in the Bahamas in the Caribbean. The almost vertical Blue Hole measures 130 meters in diameter at its surface entrance and 36 meters at its very bottom, 
where there's literally no water flow or exchange with the rest of the ocean. Water in the lower part of a deep blue hole like Dragon Hole is stagnant and anoxic, with nearly no water circulation and thus unfavorable for most sea life. But nonetheless, it can support large colonies of bacteria. Number 1. Springs of the Satina River There are many national parks in Croatia, one more beautiful than the other. There are two in the Sibenik region, the Kurka Waterfalls and the Kornati Islands. A lot of advertising has been done and buses and boats full of tourists visit them, but not this one, Frele Satine, the springs of the Satina River. Not many tourists come in the spring season, but it is a place worthwhile visiting. One thing is for sure, you'll be impressed by the beauty of the spring and the crystal clear water. You'll never see water more clear than here. The Satina River emerges on the surface at the southeast part of Dinara Mountain near Satina Village at the altitude of 395 meters. The Satina is one of the four most beautiful Croatian rivers. Vrela Setin covers an area of almost 30 hectares and has been protected since 1971 as the hydrogeological heritage of nature. No acts that threaten its features and values are permitted in this area. Its source is really amazing. It's easily described as a huge 100-meter deep perpendicular chasm filled with crystal clear water. When you go there, please preserve nature, don't enter the water and do not throw stones into the water. Thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed the video please let me know by clicking the like button, do share, write a comment and don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch up my next video.